some exciting coming attractions from Paramount. Hold on a minute, don't you think we ought to talk? What about how I'm gonna run? Sure. About how you managed to live as long as you have. I think he can drive. Oh, he can drive. He can drive beyond the limits of the tires, the engine, the car, anything else. There's nothing I can't do with a race car. <laughs> well, that's the difference between you and me. There's only so much I can do. You want me to work the pit and you drive? You run good? Thank you. And we'll see how you do in the crowd. I was desperate to get your attention. Well, you got it. I've walked into a jungle. Come up here and do it. I'll take you to a race. Really, I can't. I'm a doctor. I'm cool. You think your driving can improve? I'll take your word for what a car can do, but I'm not taking anybody's word for what I can do. I don't want you to hold a bad opinion of Cole. I believe it scares him. He needs reassurance from you that he's okay. And after all, uh... How could you ignore me like that? I wasn't ignoring you. You're his doctor. See, a driver gets his bell rung and a couple of lights flicker. And loses what he needs more than his eyesight, more than his reflexes. More than anything in the world. I've raced with my legs broke, heart bruised, eyes popping out of my head like they're on springs. He loses his need. The need to drive right out there on the ragged edge. He doesn't believe you can drive anymore. How long before you find out? If you're really good. You just want to race again. Oh, you're really lucky. You get back in that car and you'll die. Coming this February to video stores everywhere. We've sold the casinos. All businesses having to do with gambling. We have no interests or investments in anything illegitimate. Don Corleone. The Corleone family. Partners with the Pope. They may cry blasphemy. This is business. The long-awaited third chapter of the Godfather trilogy has begun. Writer-director Francis Ford Coppola and co-screenwriter Mario Puzo are reunited with those who made Godfather 1 and 2 among the most celebrated films in motion picture history and winners of nine Academy Awards, including two for Best Picture. Al Pacino returns as Michael Corleone. If every drug pusher in this room were to drop dead, I would be the only one alive. Diane Keaton as Kay. You know, Michael, now that you're so respectable, I think you're more dangerous than you ever were. While Andy Garcia stars as Vincent, portraying the next generation. I said we make him dead, you give me the order, I'll take care of it. <laughs> Everyone look toward me, nice, beautiful smile, the Corleone family, very good. And Vincent, try to smile, will you, Vincent? And go! And once more, the Corleone legend intertwines with the Coppola family. His sister, Talia Shire, and his daughter, Sophia Starr. His father, Academy Award winner Carmine, will write and conduct the musical score. While his uncle, Anton, produces and conducts the operatic sequences. Okay, here we go. Tradition of wealth and power. I command 
this family, right or wrong. To take a little time, we will find you part one, two, three. Loyalty and honor. I'm a Corleone. Passion and politics. You're the only one left in this family with my father's strength. Betrayal. The car will come up, the guy will greet him, and race him, and walk out of hand. And violence. But you want everybody, my father, my father. I know you're into banks on Wall Street, but everyone knows you're a fire warrior like the Supreme Court. All I want to do is protect you from these guys, and your lawyers can't do that. The compelling saga of the Corleone family continues with The Godfather Part 3. Just when I thought I was out, they pulled me back in. Thank you.